hello you guys welcome back to my youtube channel so wait i don't understand why my head is shining like this my forehead anyway just ignore it <laughs> let's focus on the talk of the day by the way i hope you guys have been fine and i hope your preparation towards coming to the uk to study has been going well um as usual you know you can always send me a message or leave a comment and i'll get back to you and answer whatever questions you might have and if i do not know i would tell you where you'd most likely find the answer to that information so um i'm making this video because i have an update so some people have asked me to you know give you guys an update when the ofs page is updated i feel like i'm saying updates too much anyway um some people have sent me messages on that too so i just figured it would be better you know to make a video rather than you know just individual 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 so yes the ofs page has been updated and um i mean the official page not my school page because actually turns out my school is not giving any scholarships under the ofs scheme this year so but you can go to the ofs page and i'm going to leave a link in the description box so you can click on it and it will tell you or it will show you the schools that are still part of the scheme this year and are going to be having scholarships so you can click on each one find out if you meet the terms or what you need to do and yes i mean some of the schools on there i'm certain they give african students for example coventry is there i know people that have gotten their seaside hall bradford solent university q so there are many investors there that's people other africans have gotten or international students have gotten and you can also get so yes that's basically it i just needed to you know put this video out there so that you can check out and um as usual if you have any other questions or you want to know something or if for example you'd like me you know to link you up with someone i know that has gotten the scholarship maybe in a school you're interested in so you can talk to them because that's something i actually advise or get one or two information you can message me on instagram and i would reach out to the person on your behalf and as long as they are cool with it i'll be fine with linking them up with you because even besides the scholarship it's always good to talk to current students or alumni of any school you're interested in so yes i know this would probably be disappointing for people who have applied to the university of suffolk and we're hoping to come this year but then i mean if you're heavily reliant on the scholarship then it's probably best to start applying to other schools on the ofs page but if you know the money is not a problem and you are just hoping one kind one kind for the scholarship then definitely i look forward to seeing you at the university of suffolk so you guys until next time until i continue my job series see you guys bye